Galapao is steamed bun filled with pork and eggs. How to make steamed bun with pork and egg filling, also known as galapao. At Asian supermarket, purchase one package of galapao mix. Look for the picture of the steamed bun and there should be directions at the back. So, with one package, add one half cup of sugar and one cup of soy milk, or you can use just milk. Knead the dough for one minute and then add one tablespoon of oil and then knead the dough for another four minutes. Once all the ingredients are incorporated, the dough should be firm and less sticky and then leave to set for 15 to 20 minutes. In the meantime, cut two by two squares of wax paper and you need about 12 squares of cut wax paper. Now let's prepare the filling. These are quail eggs and I boil them for 15 minutes. If you're going to use regular eggs, boil them for 20 minutes and then cut the eggs in four. But with quail eggs, you do not need to cut them. Remove the shell of the hard boiled egg. The next ingredient are Chinese sausages, which are sweet. And some people will cut them into 12 large pieces, but I like to cut them into smaller pieces. The last filling is ground pork, so let's prepare the ground pork. Take one clove of garlic and chop finely, as well as one bulb of shallot or half of onions and chop finely as well. You need one quarter cup of chopped garlic and onions. The next ingredients are mushrooms and I like to use dry mushrooms that are brown and you need to soak them in hot water for about 20 minutes. Once the mushrooms are soft, drain any excess water and chop the mushrooms into fine pieces. With one cup of ground pork, add the chopped garlic, shallots and mushrooms. Add some salt and pepper as well as about two tablespoons of oyster sauce or hoisin sauce. Mix all the ingredients together and if the sweet sausages are cut small, I will also add them into the pork filling mix. Now that the filling is prepared, it should be about 20 minutes and the dough has risen. Knead the dough for about 2 minutes and then after 2 minutes, divide the dough into 12 equal balls. I've tried making my own dough with all-purpose flour and then adding rising ingredients, but it just doesn't turn out quite right, so it's better just to go to the Asian supermarket and get the package. Now let's wrap everything together. Sprinkle some flour onto a cutting board and then roll out the dough so that it is round and flat. Roll it out so that the dough is slightly bigger than the palm of your hands. Then add a quail egg, sweet sausages, and one tablespoon of the ground pork. Then you want to take the opposite sides and squeeze the dough together so that the seam is sealed. For best practice and presentation, the seam should all gather in the middle and then there should not be any air pockets or holes. Take one small sheet of wax paper and place it at the bottom of the steam bun and then place the steam bun on to a Thai Lao steamer. Fill the pot until it reaches 2 inches of water and then add 2 tablespoons of white vinegar. Steam for 10 minutes, then lift the lid to remove any condensation that is underneath the lid and then steam again for 10 more minutes. The reason for the wax paper is so that it doesn't stick to the steamer and you need to remove the wax paper before enjoying the steam bun. Normally, you would bite into this, but I just want to show you what the inside looks like. And this is how you make steam bun with pork and egg filling, also known as galapao. Visit me at labthome.com for more Thai and Lao videos and recipes, and to also get the recipe book.